Bretton Woods, New Hampshire, delegates from 44 allied and associate countries arrived for the opening of the United Nations Monetary and Financial Conference. Invited by President Roosevelt to the first major world financial meeting since the London Conference of 1933, they will work in the seclusion of this White Mountains resort. Zhang Shi Kung, one of China's representatives, with Secretary and Mrs. Henry Morgenthau. United States Treasury Secretary Morgenthau heads the American delegation. On the opening day, in his role of acting conference president, he addresses the meeting. To be discussed are plans for the stabilization of world currencies. All agreements must be ratified by the governing bodies of the nations involved before becoming effective. Delegates to this monetary and financial conference pose on the hotel lawn. These meetings are designed to promote trade in the post-war world and to create a foundation for lasting peace. Woods, New Hampshire, delegates from 44 allied and associate countries arrived for the opening of the United Nations Monetary and Financial Conference. Invited by President Roosevelt to the first major world financial meeting since the London Conference of 1933, they will work in the seclusion of this White Mountains resort. Zhang Shi Kung, one of China's representatives, with Secretary and Mrs. Henry Morgenthau. United States Treasury Secretary Morgenthau heads the American delegation. On the opening day, in his role of acting conference president, he addresses the meeting. To be discussed are plans for the stabilization of world currencies. All agreements must be ratified by the governing bodies of the nations involved before becoming effective. Delegates to this monetary and financial conference pose on the hotel lawn. These meetings are designed to promote trade in the post-war world and to create a foundation for lasting peace. Mm -hmm. 